Hello, my lovely Libras. How are you, loves? I hope everyone is doing well. Libra, welcome to one of our special readings. And special readings are questions from you, loves. It's a timeless reading, but for the reference, will be put for April readings. So the question looks like, what should I do to get better? Or what are those messages that are coming through in the situation where I am to be in a better energy, to be in a better side? Let's see, loves. What you should do? What are those messages? What spirit wants you to know? And what are the guidance for you at this time? As a general reading, loves, Many messages might really connect with whatever you are going through. And many other messages might do not. So be aware, loves. Let's see. What you should do to get in a better energy. This might be a very pleasant message. This might be a very harsh message. So be aware of that too. Five of Cups. Two of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, Moon, Tower, and Five of Pentacles. Somebody here is afraid to lose their job or whatever they are working out there. Could be family, or it's kind of like, what are you afraid to that's gonna happen? Sorry for saying, but we have a Queen of Pentacles here. So there's something here that you gotta take care of you, or you need to do what is right for you. Queen of Pentacles speaks about self-care, 3D energy. For some of you, it's about your work, that it's quite a burden that doesn't fulfill you emotionally, neither financially. But you don't want to live with no job because you feel like you work so hard to be in this place. It's something here you love about it. But there's more that you hate about it. And I feel here this is something about your abundant energy. Three and five makes the eight and two makes the ten. So your ten of pentacles is out there. Know that. But clearly something, and you know, doesn't work. For some of you, might feel like the company you work is not in a good shape. Not be you. Might not be you. Queen of Pentacles also is someone who has a job. Okay. Let's see. But definitely here you are, you are procrastinating to stay or to leave. To let it go or not yet. Full moon in um, in Scorpio. Moon and Tower speaks about Scorpio energy. Moon in Scorpio. We have in May. For some of you, May month might be quite significant. But Five of Cups really speaks about the, um, the things. It's like you don't want to repeat uh, a world cycle or certain things here from the past. Or you don't want to feel like you used to feel in the past or something like that. Let's see here. The what you are afraid. The moon. Wheel of fortune. The universe will provide. So Spirit says to get in a better situation, stop being afraid of the worst. Because I see here you are thinking of the worst. The tower, queen of wands.
you feel like you you don't desire like queen of wands is about passion it's like i'm waking up in the morning it's just kind of like i don't have that let's go let's do the things doesn't feel like it's something here that you you might feel a little in a dark place libra but i feel here there is something here about taking a break or you need some rest five of pentacles page of wands there's certain things here you definitely need to try and to not be afraid to try. For some of you, you are in between your job and an idea about what you have work-wise. You feel here your idea will not bring you any money or the things will not gonna work. Ace of Wands is to Lealer in the moment. Seven of Wands, but you wanna keep it you need to make so much effort to be or to have it three of wands but you have big hopes for it empress that will pick up whatever here you hope for but i feel here with a lot of effort with a lot of work with a lot of perseverance. And also I feel here you gotta stay as much as possible into a high vibration or positive hope. Because the things might not look now good, but they will be a big boom for you five of cups clarifier chariot there's definitely something here you gotta let go behind and don't even look back whatever that is two of pentacles king of swords getting clear and not doubt and ten of wands hang man what are you sacrificing for? What are you hanging there for? And how you see the things, which you need to start seeing the things a little different than you are doing now. Everything is heavy, everything is hard, everything doesn't go the way it is. It's kind of like shift your perception differently. You're not a tree to stay where you are. You are not a statue to stay in one place. It's kind of take the move. King of Swords. Don't go back and forth, back and forth. Maybe yes, maybe no. Should I stay, should I leave? Should I stay, should I leave? Because I feel here it's getting heavier, harder for you and at one point you will for those of you who are thinking should I leave my job for my passion I feel here that is for I feel here whatever you are passionate and whatever here you want will grow but will not grow fast or quicker as you think. For some of you, you might take a chance or you might be in between should I take a job, should I leave what I start or whatever I want to start. The fact is that things will improve, but I feel here you gotta be patient because it might take time. 
and whatever here you you feel very lost or down you gotta see it as a blessing because sometimes the universe offers certain detours so trust in the divine detours because that detour given to you is the guidance how you can scale up when you go forward more messages here for the Libra Six of Wands, Eight of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, and the Devil. Think positive. Whatever here you feel like you can do it, you absolutely can because the universe gives you a whole different opportunity there. Okay. Whatever here is changing will make you more humble, more appreciative for what you have and not what you don't have, what, what you could have. So you are not less than what you've been or what you could be your value is still who you are so you don't decrease your value on the contrary you are increasing much more than you think so libra darling there's something here you need to let go don't procrastinate don't try to control it because I feel here it's not really up to you. I feel also there is an energy that really speaks off. You will have a detour because you can move because before you can move forward fast or the way you want. So to get better in the situation is to accept a detour to not be afraid of the universe guidance to accept the universe guidance sometimes certain storms are not to make you weak on the contrary to make you stronger and whatever storm is here is to move you in such a way that probably you don't see it now and that's the Empress it's hard but it's not impossible For some of you, I see a Libra who going through a, a health issue, could be a depression. I feel here going outside more, meditating more, looking for new things, learning new things. That definitely will improve you. As well, I feel here there is some um, workshops or some kind of courses you gotta take to improve because I feel here there's certain things here you can't see yet but you will in a very short time so we have from the Denise Lean sacred traveler cards the oracles we have protected by angels you are cherished by the angels the spirits are protecting you from lower vibrations as well as guiding you where to move towards or how to and surrendering to the journey releasing control that's the devil energy here 
the control issues. You can control certain things. Nobody can, especially when the universe intervention is happening. So release them. Go with the flow. You know, probably you heard these words, God with you. That's how, how things or Let God put the things in order or let the universe work its magic. That's what now you need to look into as well. That being said, loves, thank you for coming forward. Much appreciation. And we'll see you next time. Namaste.